Hey, what's going on, y'all? It's Brother D coming at y'all with another video. And, um, um, I want to talk about uh, Bradley Bill going to the Golden State Warriors. And I think that this is a good move for Golden State. Because, let's be honest, um, he's one of the most elites, he's one of the best elite scorers in the NBA. And you got to think, with Klay Thompson being 31, Draymond being, Green being 31, these guys will be 32 years old in, what, March? March? And Stephen Curry will be 34 in March on March 14th of 2022. So they're getting older, and they're, they're, they've indicated to Warriors management that they want to win, and they want to win now. That they don't have time to wait on rookies to grow up. Um, I think that they're, they're doing the right thing. What I think with that seventh and fourteenth pick, I think gonna, they're going to take that pick, and they're going to use it as assets to go to go um, get a Bradley Bill or another All Star, somebody that they can help, that can help them immediately. And you know, I like the kid. Um, um, Andrew Wiggins, but he's just not he's not consistent enough. And if I'm them, and he's making what like 31 million this season? 31 million for a guy that you can't count on. He might give you 25 one night, but give you 14 one night. You need some consistent. If if I'm the Warriors, I go get Bradley Bill. Because you don't know how Clay Thompson gonna come off that injury, you gotta have some type of insurance. So just in case something happened with him, um, then you have a another scoring op option. And with Clay Thompson, you might can move him to the small forward. Since you know with the, the Achilles injury, um, I don't think he's gonna be able to the, um, to defend uh, smaller guards. So I think with him going to that small forward, it would be a good it would be a good um, be a good situation for him because then he'll be too quick for for um, bigger bigger small forwards. So I think it's a win it's a win win move, and you know I just think that that these guys are in their thirties, they trying to get a couple more rings before they retire. They ain't got time to sit around and wait on people to grow up. They don't have time for that. So, you know, I'm all for the, you know, the, you know, Bradley Bill going to the Golden State Warriors. And then I looked on, you know, through my YouTube um, feed and I ain't calling no names or nothing. But a person says that, you know, they say that Stephen Curry is trying to build a super team. How is this a super team? How is that? How is that? Draymond Green cannot score. He's a great defender, but he cannot score. Klay Thompson, you don't know how he's going to come back from this injury. You don't know how he's going to come back. Steph has virtually no help. Him going to Bradley Beal going to the Warriors is not a bad look. They got to get help. And are they trying to win and win now? So how is that a super team? It, it just goes to show you that some people, they just hate on Stephen Curry. No matter what he does, people are just going to continue to hate, and I don't understand why. They haven't made the playoffs in two years. So how is this a super team if Bradley Bill go to the Warriors? You tell me that. They need another score. Because even with Klay Thompson, they still going to need another score. They don't have enough shooters. And Wiggins, you can't depend on him. Um, Jordan Poole is is un, unproven. Um, Damon Lee, he's shaky. You don't know how he's going to come. Um, Juan Tostano Anderson, he's not a real scorer. <coughs> they need people that can score. They trying to win and win now. So how is that? A super team in Bradley Bill go to the Warriors. That makes no sense. Come on, man.
But, you know, this would be a good move for the Warriors because they need scoring badly. Steph can't do it all by himself. And then, you know, if Clay gets hurt, then they know they got another scoring option. So this would be a good move if they traded for Bradley Bill. But that's, that's it. That's all. Brother D, deuces.